a straight up butcher shop. That's what we are. We cut and grind and process everything that we do in house. To come through the door at Sally Stevens store is like. I started here when I was about 14. Coming into her home. Every inch of it. And walking the aisles. You gotta bring home the good stuff, <laughs> you know? Is to take a trip around the triad. We've got our farm fresh eggs here, um, which we have a lady in Madison who produces these for us. Um, we have our preserves, our jellies from um, the Dutch kettle, which is in Hampton Beal. She has not just a full meat section with the healthiest options. Thick cut, $12.99 a pound. Which one is looking at you, man? She also has the things you'll need to round out your meals. Fresh produce that we keep in stock. And that local theme continues. Our niece's counter here, 90% of our vendors are North Carolina companies that supply our products, um, all of our fresh beef, pork, and chicken. Since they do all of their own work, they have state inspectors in their store five days a week, something they consider a real advantage for their business. And it's even bigger for our customers because we send you home with the assurance that our products have been handled right. There's no preservatives, no additives, no solutions. It's all fresh meat. So folks for the first time come in and they're like, everything tastes so different because it's fresh meat and it's real fresh meat. We have plenty of everything. But that's only part of the reason that they've thrived in an era when the grocery business seems to be moving towards the mega store. I think that's where our service comes in. You don't have to come in and shop the counter and only take what's out there. Um, you can have it cut how you want, package how you want, your choice. So with that, we're, we're back at that old school customer service. And with old school sourcing, getting things locally, that's been a secret to why they never ran out of product. I really appreciate you. And provides a lesson. Support your local companies. Going forward. Stay local as local as you can because at the end of it, we still seem to find a way to pull through. Bob Buckley. Bye, guys. Fox 8 News. Thanks very much. Y'all have a blessed day, okay?